This is a video on how to view your Dibbles assessment data. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to open up this assessments uh, ribbon and then click on assessment profile. I'm going to go ahead and choose the class that I want to look at. Or if you'd like to look at all the students of a particular grade, you can leave this blank and leave it as choose class. I think I'm going to look at all my SK students in this case. I'm going to choose the grade and then choose the assessment that I'd like to take a look at. So these are all my SK students um, for the Dibbles SK screener at the beginning of the year. And you can see that they are all here. Um, some features of this screen. You can expand this bar graph right here and it will hover over top so you can see the different scores. You can also quickly see who does not have data entered for them. So for example, I'm missing data for three students. You can also have a number of different sorting features. So you can sort by first name, last name, using these little arrows at the top. A useful piece would be to sort this uh, by color, by their benchmarks. So I'm gonna have all the students who are at risk for letter naming fluency come to the top. Then you can see I have all my students who are at risk, followed by some risk, followed by our green meeting expectations or exceeding expectations. You can also filter for your other category. So for example, if I want to see the students, all the students who are at risk for PSF come to the top, I can filter that there. If I'd rather filter the other way, I can have those students move towards the bottom. One other thing that you can do in the graph is you can download this as an image if you'd like to have that image um, saved into uh, a different part of your computer so you could use it for documents. And that is how you would view your assessment profiles in Compass. Thanks for listening.